Gundam, there's something I want to ask you. Okay. When the alarm rang at the Strawberry House Lounge, you rushed over there too, right? Uh oh. Uh oh. What's wrong with that? If the bell of catastrophe rings throughout the oh, night, shut up. it is the yeah. universe's problem. Fuck your universe. Stop it. Why were you able to hear it? Hear what? I mean, you were also staying in a deluxe room, right? Nagito was staying in a deluxe room in the same house on the same floor, and he couldn't even hear it. Well, he's also a so creeper. Why you able to hear that but why were you able to hear it? Now that you mention it, uh -oh. Gundam? There is only one possibility. You weren't in your room at the time. Uh -oh. You were out killing people. Even though you were staying in a deluxe room, you still went to the lounge. Am I right? Gundam, um, you have some sort of explanation, right? Does he? Does he? He couldn't return to his room because of Fuyuhiko. Me? Oh yeah, because he was watching, watching out. Why was he out of his room? You stayed at the lounge for a while. Am I correct? Yeah, well, that's a good question, actually. Until the moment that alarm started. I guess he just hung out in the lounge. He's like, if you can't were in sleep. The lounge for that long, yeah, maybe. The killer who had left earlier obviously wouldn't be able to go back. We we might have learned why like earlier in the trial, but I don't remember. Trap that utilized the alarm in his chest. The killer still needed to prepare the murder in advance. Oh boy. Like putting Nekomaru in sleep mode and tying him up in the water. Yeah. In order to do that, the killer needed to be waiting for Nekomaru at the tower. Which means when Fuyuhiko witnessed Nekomaru, the killer was already oh, just waiting there. Right, that's gross. And once they tried to go back, they couldn't because Fuyuhiko was at the lounge. In their so he, he was like cock blocking him from getting back that's to his for room. Sure. Yeah. The and they were supposed to stay in their room. They weren't planning to come out and go to the lounge. Which means they wouldn't have heard the alarm or the rumbling sound. Thus proving they were in the room. There you go. Yep. The best case scenario would have been if those two in the lounge had gone to check the deluxe rooms. After all, but no one else was. They were stupid. It gives the killer a strong uh -oh. alibi. Unfortunately, they failed to secure that alibi because I was in the lounge. Oh right. no! But that means if you weren't there, we never would have figured anything out. So the True. Couldn't go back to their room. And ended up hearing the lounge's alarm. So he rushed over. Yeah, what are you doing? What are you doing? Uh... But why'd you come out? You should have hid till the excitement died. Really stupid. If stupid. Gundam tried to hide, and if those two went to his room to check on him, he would have been found out. Yeah, he couldn't. Well, why that would they would have, have checked been the out? Worst possible outcome. That's why he couldn't just stay here. I mean, it, it was just it was just an assumption that they would check. So this was just a coincidence, right? Really. Yeah. Coincidence. That's that's really that's contrived though when there's coincidences involved. Right, I agree. Lounge, your plan was doomed. Gunna, please, can you at least say something? Answer me this. Oh. Including myself. Are you gonna defend yourself? How many ears do we have? Yeah, okay. Ten? The answer is ten. Yes. That's right. I possess ten ears. Oh, are you, are you... really? That means I have five That's not how it works. Oh, shit. No, you don't. The soundproof system here may as well... <laughs> is that your argument? <laughs> is that your argument? Bastard. Do you understand the situation you're in right now? Really? Do not panic. The truth oh. shall now commence. At the time, I left my room to go to the bathroom. By coincidence, I heard the alarm. Yeah. That's right. That's all. That's not an alibi. The world is always so simple. Are you saying it was just a coincidence? Isn't that timing? A I mean, the timing is kind of a little too perfect it that is. Fuyuhiko was there in the first I place. Agree. Yet, I'm being suspected by all of you. It seems it was actually horrible timing on my That's part. Sure. I see. You're still holding out. What, what, what is that hand gesture? Well, it's, you don't, I don't have know. to admit it. We're going to decide who the killer is with the majority vote anyway. So, why don't we just go ahead and start voting? Well, now you're starting to rush things along. Yeah, that's too killer. fast. Uh, hold on a sec. You know, Hajime, this class trial, this killing, it's merely the opening act. What? What? Hey! What 
do you mean that class trial is just the I mean we're more than halfway through the game so that's not true it's just a farce oh what does he know does he know boring farce so boring so stressful why why is he say is he saying that this is all fake I don't know let's just hurry up and finish this before I collapse from poor health Nagito something definitely really? happened to you yeah, remember he right. found the documents. At right. some point during the investigation, your behavior became even weirder. What? What actually happened? Did you discover something? Yeah, what the hell did yeah, you discover? You did. Well, let's just leave that fun for later. And finish oh, this God. opening act already. Don't hold it back. Said opening act again. Please hold on. We have yet to hear Gundam's people. <laughs> Bless you. Oh, thank you. But he's completely shut up. Perhaps he can Or maybe he doesn't want to argue. Gundam! <laughs> I was simply at a loss for words after being... Okay, so give us your argument. Okay. In fact, I shall deny the very basis. Your assumption has been wrong since the beginning. Okay. He says assumption, weird. Since the beginning? Based on your assumption... Assumption? I hung Nekomaru from the fourth floor of the tower and made the floor... Hey, I never said that. Okay. Actually, I did, so never mind. After returning to Strawberry, that's that's how you uh. Present when the alarm that's how you how you get people to admit correct. to things. I never All said that. To and fro is busy enough as it is. I, I fucked up that joke by not giving an example, but I don't care. Both houses anyway. I see. The contact elevator was broken. As I recall, the killer tampered with the Grape House control panel. But how could he do that? Well. Plus, the stopped elevator should have been facing the Grape House. Oh God, I don't. If so, the Th this is like shit you need spatial relations for. That's true. And like remembering them. For these reasons, what the hell is that word? Indisputable? No, the, 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 no, I'm the like per a perception thing where when you don't have, when you don't Visual? see something. Yeah. No, it's uh. It's like, you know how like when babies, when you like hide your face from babies, it's yeah. gone to them? Right, right. I, don't I can't know remember the called. word. Yeah. No. Uh, However, I was already at Strawberry House. I was present when the alarm in the lounge started ringing, which means your assumption is clearly wrong. Okay, so he's arguing that uh, and here I thought it's already been that he was at a uh, he couldn't have done it because he was at the different house. Right. Pitiful humans, you cannot overcome this contradiction. That's wrong. When something is obviously wrong, that's when a contradiction is born. There's no such thing as a contradiction that can't be overcome. All right, all what the? Right. What? <laughs> okay. All right. Uh. So the contradiction is. What the fuck? I don't think it's. I didn't. No. Huh? The only means of travel between the two houses. That that's not true. As long as that elevator was broken. Your assumption collapses. Uh. Plus, wait. Elevator was broken at Grape House. Right. Wait, no, that's not. The killer cannot return to Strawberry House. Since I was at Strawberry House at that time, there's no question that the following crime is impossible. I th I thought it was uh. An accomplice. No, there's no accomplice. There was a secret passageway. If there's not a secret passageway. What? Why don't we stop this already? I, I thought it was the one where the Nagito's sudden appearance, but that's not it. Uh. That elevator well, hold on a sec. The only means of travel okay, uh. Well, what do I have? Between the two houses. Well, well, contact elevator is one of them. What does what does contact elevator say? No, it was apparently broken at the Grape House, so it, the last person to use it would have arrived at Grape House. I mean that's what he's arguing, so that elevator was broken. Uh your assumption collapses. It's not wall clock, it's not no, alarm it's timer, it's not radio house. clock. Uh Grape house. Hold on a sec. Broken doorknob. No, because that's a that's a different elevator, yeah, so I don't think no. that's part of it. Uh Shit. Cannot return to Strawberry House. Since I was at Strawberry House, at that, there's no question that the following crime is would have been different if they hadn't accomplished. I, I, wait, what does that say? No. How much longer do you? Why don't we stop this? Already? I think it's gotta be. 
I want to say it's contact elevator, but that doesn't make sense. I mean, let me try it anyway. The only means of travel between the two houses. Okay, that's not it. Uh. Damn it! Oh! Oh, I know what it is. Okay. Oh, I love when you remember. I have to. Uh, I have to do this. Okay, hold on. How much longer do you? Why don't we stop this already? Because Nagito had the thing. I don't. I don't know why they wouldn't just like show Nagito's sudden appearance there, but whatever. Okay. Let me get all these out of here. Yep, that was it. Okay. No, that's wrong. Okay. 